So recently in the Street Fighter 6 scene, I have noticed personally, now you might have noticed something different, the people are always talking about JP is good, really, uh, really good right now. Ken is really good right now. Cammy is really good right now. And I think a character that people know is really good still, but maybe hasn't performed at a higher level of, you know, winning certain majors. I mean, even Blanc is out there winning majors. It's DJ. This is everybody's menace. You know, week one, week two, Street Fighter 6. Oh, my God. DJ's drive rush is crazy fast. And it is. <laughs> it is quite fast. And the fact that he can drive rush after, uh, you know, his EX fireball is kind of sussy baka. However, uh, Fudo, you know, very renowned Japanese player playing DJ. I believe he used to play Dalsum uh, before DJ when I took a look at his stats. He, he's uh, he's also a Dawson player, right? So, which is kind of interesting. You got a zoner, and then you got, like, DJ can zone, per se. I guess Dawson is also a zoner if you play him correctly. You know, yeah, I guess both these fit the same narrative. They both have really good zoning tools. And if they both just want to be on top of you and mix you up, I guess they can honestly both do that. But, yeah, of course, if you like the video, please subscribe, button, comment, down below, leave a like. Uh, we got Udo fighting against Tokido, playing Ken, um... Uh, Dosuko, damn dude, I don't want to mispronounce that. Esports, a JP player, really good, and a Cami player. So as you see, I kind of, you know, I can a JP a Cami. I want to see what he does against these specific matchups that are very good right now. Oh man, you know, I put a, I put a lot into this content, man. I put a lot, a lot of like little things like that. Maybe it's not little to you, but it's little to me. Pretty happy though. Pretty excited. Pretty excited to see what Fudo does. I mean, he. This was a custom room, time, so Tokido did win a few matches, Fudo won a few matches, but I want to see the matches that he did win, because this was, this was towards the end of their set, which means both players have a good understanding of each other's game plan, or right now they're, uh, you know, right now they are adapting to each other. Tokido does get the first hit, Ken's corner carry is a bonkers, cross cuts, can't do that on Tokido, brother. Just hold up, man. Hold up. Just hold up. Very curious. Now, DJ does have really good buns with that stay in medium kick. The one flaw of DJ is the fact that not a lot of his buttons are... Oh. What is that? Wait, wait, wait. What? Does this show? I want to see what this is. Minus three? I wonder what I wonder what oh whoopsie. I wonder what uh Tokido hit. To get counter hit. Minus three, so I mean he could have matched probably like crouching light punch. If we try to go for a medium punch. I mean we could just see it on the right. I, I don't want to remind it for, for the 19th time, I'm sorry. Yeah, that's such a good and this is why I think DJ's really good, man. He has really good combo routes. I mean, that's why I don't think DJ is really good because of combos like this, because of his zoning, because of his rush down, because of his drive rush, right? Like I said, every character though does have their own thing. You can, if you are godlike and you can predict the future, you can DI a lot of his normals because they're not special cancelable. He can DI punish it. However, is that going to happen nine times out of 10? Probably not, but it is there to know. It is there to know. That heavy kick. His stay medium punch is already plus, so driver stay medium punch just makes that better. There we go. What I say? Look at that damage, dude, from a EX fireball. He just said 31% of your HP. Isn't that crazy? Oh no. Punish counter. Doesn't go in for the kill. I wonder why he didn't do like a killing combo. I think he would have built. I think he, I don't know, maybe he could have not built the uh, the level 2 in time, if Fudo knew that. That's just great meter management, I guess, right? That's just, that's just great meter management. But yeah, now he's in checkmate. I would hit EX Fireball, just to be safe. I would hit EX Fireball. But, uh, I mean, uh, hey, everything works, man. Everything works out here with Fudo. Everything works. You know, I guess, I guess, honestly, I should not be saying jack and or shit i'm just an observer fudo knows what he's doing right i should not even 
If he's doing something, it's probably the right choice. Probably the right. I'm only 1700 MMR, maybe like 1695 now. I think I lost the rake matches. Oh, wow. Tries to, oh my good perfect parry. Dude, the parry is still crazy. The amount of perfect parries I've seen as of, I think as of Gamers A with Kakaru. I feel like I see a perfect parry, or I even land a perfect parry like once every match now. Which might not seem that impressive, but I don't think anybody was really utilizing parry like that in the early stages of Street Fighter 6. What's on? Um, once again, it's just all stuff that I've seen. Level 1. Yep. That was a cool combo. 15 hits. 15 hits, a very low scaling combo. That's right. Ken, you're so fucking ugly, dude. Dude, why is why does his face look like that? He has like such a sharp jaw. I don't remember Ken having such a having such a triangular jaw. In older games. I always felt like he had like a flat jaw. No, I guess Ryu got the square face when you think about it. Ryu got a square face, Ken got a triangle face. It's like their dynamic. Alright, so yeah, right now, my bad. Takito's uh putting Shudo Fudo. Shudo. Playing Fudo in the corner. Did put himself in a burnout. Wakes up with level two. He, he wins this? No shot. This is how it starts. Don't tell me you get throw loop 17 times. Don't don't do it. Don't do it to him, Fudo. Don't do it to him. Tries to shimmy the throw. That's three now. Are you dead? Level two? Level one. You know, it doesn't matter if you're platinum, gold, silver, fucking Tokido. You will get throw loop. It you know, sometimes you're like I'm just gonna take the throw. Sometimes I'm just gonna take the throw. Could have woke up level one. Touch the throw, man. I hate that overhead, but Harry seems to be the vibe. Fudo text throws up. He was like, listen, I know I just throw I, I know I just throw loop. I'm not gonna let you throw my ass though. Oh, you're dead. Oh no! You were dead! Oh now you're dead. Damn, and with the level three? It's not the CA. We don't gotta watch it. We don't gotta watch it. It's not the CA. He just he just he just fucking punches him in the dick 19 times. All he does is just punch you in the dick, man. DJ, stop punching them in the dick. Fuck, man. Like we told you about this. That's not this. I know we said it's a street fight, but there's still rules. You don't, don't hit another man in the dick. All right, JP, right? Uh, the, 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 the true <laughs> the true antagonist of Street Fighter, it lower wise and esports wise. Damn. Nice good punish counter. Good empty jump by the by the way. Look at that empty jump. The empty jump so he doesn't extend his hurt box. Uh, so JP whiffs his, uh, anti-air, which is his, uh, crouching heavy punch, and then he gets a punish counter. I need to start doing that more against JPs and stuff. I don't empty jump ever. I'm always throwing out a fucking button in the air. Oh, damn it. Good punish counter, you're dead. You are dead. You're... Okay, I was like, wait, 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 is he not? No, he's dead, he's dead. It's, it's crazy, because I haven't seen Fudo do a single thing I see American JPs do. Oh, is that like, like, I feel like he's not doing, he has never used his crouching medium pick a single time. American JPs love DJ's crouching medium pick. And I don't think Fudo has done it once. Which just shows like the level of like how different countries are when they play this game. Uses the, you know, the sway overhead a lot more. Oh, damn. No. I like it when JP says that to you. No. Yeah, I'm gonna get MK1. I'm gonna get MK1. I'm gonna play smoke. I'm gonna play smoke. Also, Fudo plays DJ in such a way that requires patience that I don't think American DJ players have. 
Like, uh, you can't tell an American DJ player not to throw a fireball every, like, six seconds if they're mid-screen. Oh, finally using the crouching medium kick. Level two does go through projectiles. Good pressure coming out. Good anti-air. Bro, that anti-air by DJ is, like, really good. It's not the, the best, but it's reliable, right? It's very reliable, which is what makes it good. It doesn't do, like, Marissa or Manon, where it does, like, a hard knockdown and, you know, get good Oki. Oh, my God, you're dead? No, you're not. That's not on you. That's not on you. Holy burst. Yeah, Fudo's patience is, like, honestly on a whole new level. Other than, like, what I see in over in America DJ players. They're constantly in your face, in your grill, pressing buttons, hitting something, constantly doing crouching medium kick. Fudo is just, he's Final a patient world. individual. Fight. Walking, right? An American DJ would already throw 17 uh, projectiles. Backs up. Good sway. Nice, nice. I never thought about that. I don't know. Uh, it did say punish counter. I wonder if you mistime it if uh, JP has enough time. Ooh, puts himself in a burnout. You gotta respect somebody who does their OD reversal to put himself in a burnout, right? Because that's what the opponent's not gonna think is gonna happen. Why would he put himself in a burnout? Then you fucking do it and it works out. But it looks like this JP player unfortunately couldn't make the comeback that round. Boom! I like that. That's, I don't know. I think DJ is corny, but that's like by far one of the coolest uh, win poses. Yes. This JP has never teleported. No, I lied. He's teleported a couple times. I lied. I lied. I lied. I lied. I lied. Yes. Oh, damn. Tragic. Oh, wait, maybe I lied. Maybe Fudo does use the crouching media kick. Or maybe you heard me say that he doesn't use it, and now he's not using it. Or now he's using it more. You're not dead. Right, you're not dead. He wasn't within the, uh, the 30%. Correct? Is it 30% HP? Or is it like 25? I wish you could add numbers to the health. You know? I don't know why, but I, I wish you could. Just because, like, why not? You know? Like, why, like, why not? You know, like, why not Capcom? Why can't you give me costumes yet? Uh, and why can't I have numbers in my health bar? All right, so now we're fighting against a Cami player, right? So, so Fudo did really well against that JP player, constantly applying pressure. He did get hit, I think, by every single OD amnesia. Uh, so nerf that character. <laughs> uh, but yeah, now we're on the Cami. Cami does have spin knuckle to get around uh, DJ's projectiles. Let's figure out how good this cami really is get it baby oh nice good punish you know on the first knockdown you always gotta let ex you always gotta let ex uh dp go you gotta see if your opponent's ready nice and that's that's, that's round that should be round yeah, okay. Should be, right? I am a Luke player. Oh my god, he's a Luke player. As a Luke player, that's fucking around. And DJ has a good amount of damage. He just has to spend a little bit more meter or spend his meter in different ways. Luke is just back heavy kick, drive rush, heavy punch, or, you know, that route. Wake up level two does get parry. Oh, punish counter. Oh, don't get throw loop, man. This is this is what happened. This is what you get for throw looping to Keto. Perfect, right? It doesn't matter who you are. Like I said, bronze, gold, Fudo, you will get fucking throw looped in this game. It sometimes like I'm just gonna take the throw. I don't want to get shimmied. I rather lose to a throw. That looks stupid. Grab in the air. Damn, Dude, this game player is not fucking scared, man. This game player is not fucking scared. I would have let that shit rip one more time. I would send a fucking message. Drive impact this bitch. They're not ready for the drive impact, Fudo. Drive impact. They're not ready. Oh.
Damn. That's kind of fucked up. Whiffing buns at dude, dude. That's like the biggest sign of like an alpha chat. This is the biggest sign. When you start whiffing buttons, being like, yeah, I know you're a dumbass is going to walk into it. Walk into it. That's <laughs> You might as well just fucking teabag at that point. Bro, whiffing normals like mid-screen is the same as teabagging, I feel like, in Street Fighter. It's the same as, like, I know you're gonna walk into this shit, so just walk into this shit. Alright, live game. Of course, if you liked the video, you watched it this far, please, once again, hit that subscribe button, comment down below, leave a like, we're close to 1k subscribers, man, it would mean a lot. Punish counter. Oh my god, good tech. Every DJ player is going to do this shit, man. Every DJ player is going to do this shit. Oh, 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 oh. And they fucking grab your ass, dude. That's what they're... That's all they do. Why are you mashing there, brother? Damn. You're dead? Damn. You're dead. At least I had meter and meet. Oh, fuck. Uh, DJ has a lot of personality in this game. I just hate the way his mouth is always moving. Why is his mouth always moving, man? Man, I got a piece of gum or some shit? Man's mouth always moving. Baby! Oh, good cross cut on the EXDP. That's actually impressive. Baby! Yeah, he kind of demolished the cam in this game. Level 2, and the fun part is that Fudo do be having the ri- Oh! I was about to compliment him. I was literally just about to compliment him. I was about to say Fudo has the rhythm. Turns out, uh, you know, he said, fuck you. <laughs> he said, fuck you, Arroyo. Fuck your video. Uh, yeah, so thank you everybody for tuning in. I really do appreciate it. Make sure to uh, subscribe and comment down below. Leave a like. Dude, Fudo's JP- Not JP. Fudo's DJ. A lot of, you know, letters. JP, Jamie- uh, DJ, Lily, uh, you know, I don't know, maybe I'm dyslexic or some shit, I should probably go get that shit tested, but thank you everybody, and I'll see y'all again in the next video, see ya.